guys welcome back to being being cheap yes i am in a bathroom i am in one of our bathrooms and i am working on a whole house clean maybe not the best topic for me being cheap but it's something that needs to be done and this is my life right now so you may have heard of a swedish death cleaning um not intending on dying anytime soon but this house i have been in it for 29 years it's over 3,000 square feet, and my youngest is going to be senior this year, so in case we want to have some options open um, after he graduates, I definitely don't want to be dealing with a lot of junk, and there is a lot of junk in the house, so we're doing a purge, and it's going to be one shelf a day, or one cabinet a day, or just one little area a day, and then hopefully by the time a year has rolled around, we're done. Um, so that's one shelf, one area, one cabinet. Also, at the same time, I'm trying to use, gotta keep this up in the mirror, trying to use up one item from the freezer every day, and I'm getting rid of at least one book a week, and I'm going to clean out one box of old papers or one file a week. That one takes a little bit longer because you have to go through it and either shred or make sure there's no uh, personal information showing. So we're going to start in this bathroom and we're going to go clockwise, counterclockwise. We're going to go in a circle. All right, so I'm going to first take you to this cabinet that's above the toilet. Um, let's take a look in here and see what needs to be gone. Hey, first of all, no sentimental value to this old medicine cabinet. I got it from a junk store. Uh, for the longest time, my shelves were made out of cardboard, but Michael fixed me up some really nice wooden shelves that are real. So, all right, top shelf, we've, we've got pads. Middle shelf, we've got tampons. Um, that's good to go. I don't see any need to get rid of any of that. Uh, we've got an extra toilet roll. We've got panty liners. We got more pads. Um, what do we have here? These are test strips for doing uh, the keto diet, which I do not like. Um, I think these test strips cost mm, between a seven, seven and eleven dollars. And once you open them, I think you've got thirty days to use them. These expired 2021, so we're gonna get rid of those. I'll set those on top of the toilet. Um, let's see. This is an old baby laxative thing. Don't need that. I'll go in the trash. And what do we have here? Nature's cleanse. All right, ladies, your private parts are self-cleansing. You don't need an extra solution to cleanse. This is one of those things I bought from Melaleuca. Uh, while we're on the subject of saving money, I recommend don't get signed up for any multi-level marketing thing. Um, I was doing Melaleuca for a while and they were sending me all kinds of stuff on a regular basis and I had the hardest time canceling that. So for the longest time I had a personal cleaner, I had house cleaner, I had uh, um, energy bars, energy drinks, a lot of stuff like that. Yeah, um, not a good use of money, so that's going in the trash. Okay, well, that is it on here. We have feminine hygiene and an extra toilet roll. Okay, moving right along. Um, let's see, this one's empty, that's going in the trash. Um, this was a Perry bottle. Um, during the toilet paper shortage and all that. It's gross. It's actually got mildred growing in it. Quit using this a long time ago. There is no way in heck I am squirting that on my body, much less my bum. So that's going in the trash. I'm hoping one of these years I might get a real bidet installed. So that's going in the trash. And that's soap. That needs to go in the shower. I'll set that there for now. Okay. Um. So, we'll get rid of this. That concludes today's real quick um, go through. We actually accomplished one whole cabinet and a little shelf. So we will check back in with you for more purging on a later day. Have a good one. 